morning, Council General, Zink, Her Excellency, the Governor, Representatives from Salsa's Grammar School, Warp Academy, Deputy Premier, Distinguished Guests, Ladies and Gentlemen. I'm honored to be here today for the opportunity to pay homage to the nearly 3,000 lives lost during the tragic events of September 11, 2001. We also remember Bermudians Wondell, Tanker, and Boyd Gatton. Wondell Tanker lived in Devonshire. She liked to sing and serve as a church music minister, choir instructor, and perform at weddings. A broker for Aon Corporation based in Bermuda, Rondell had accepted a two-month assignment at Aon's New York offices starting on September 10th. The next day, she was at a meeting on the South Tower's 102nd floor. Ms. Tankard would have celebrated her 52nd birthday next January. Boyd Gatton was born in Paget, Bermuda and moved to the United States in 1992. He lived in Jersey City and was an operations officer at Fiduciary Trust. He spent his free time practicing Tai Chi in the park near his home, doing carpentry work, reading, and enjoying the company of his nieces from Bermuda when they visited his, with his two sisters. Boyd Gatton would have celebrated his 59th birthday on October the 8th. Now, 20 years later, the shock and loss is remembered today, and we will continue to keep their friends and families in our thoughts and in our prayers. We will always keenly feel the losses, and I want to take a moment to recognize the incredible heroism demonstrated on that day. The first responders, the police officers, paramedics, everyone who played a part large or small to help save lives. We will always remember where we were on that day, and we will always see in our mind's eye the devastation of that day. There were many lessons learned on that day, and we must remember through unity we will overcome adversity, and we must pledge to do our part to make this world in which we live a little safer. Thank you.